Good evening. Not that we exactly need it, but another cold front with more rain is just over the Tennessee line. It's going to be working our way while we sleep tonight. There's that line now as we work our way through the overnight hours. The mountains, of course, see that rain first on the order of about four or five o'clock in the morning. The leading edge is where we will see the heaviest rain, the risk of some gusty, if not maybe even damaging winds. Greatly doubt we'll see severe weather out of this, given the fact it's coming through very early in the morning, arriving in the Charlotte area right around 8 o'clock or so. So for the peak of the morning rush, we may see some of the heaviest rainfall. Then it slides south and east. The rain itself will likely continue till about lunchtime before it tapers off as we go through the afternoon. And by the evening drive, we are A-OK. -okay. So there's no question we're going to get wet. We will likely see some gusty winds. I think we can keep the severe weather at a minimum. And flooding is something we'll have to keep an eye on. Of course, no one uh, necessarily wants the rain. We've seen the better part of double our average rainfall from the mountains to the metro uh, down to the Midlands over the last month or so. Latest future cast is uh, forecasting about a half an inch of rain for most of us, if not a little bit less than that as we go through the day on Thursday. So it's a quick hit, not enough to cause localized flooding, but it just adds insult to injury. We're on pace for the ninth wettest winter in the 142 years we've been keeping records in the Charlotte area. Now some good news. Sunshine's back on Valentine's Day, mid 50s during the day, but we will cool off at night. Other than that, it's more sunshine as we head into the weekend. Have a good night.